Uh, kia ora everyone, this next song is called E Toru Namia. It's a really easy uh, waiata, really awesome for, uh, say, for example, like Porfiri, if you have the Manuhiri coming in and they don't know any songs. Um, this is a really good one just to sing with the Manuhiri because it's just a call and response song. I'm just going to be doing the calling in the song, I'm not going to be doing the responding. Um, yeah, just because it sounds awkward if I do both, it doesn't kind of make sense. But you can imagine, like, after I say a line, then the other singers in the group would then be singing a line. Um, also, excuse the uh, average singing, it's just um, easier to teach a song, how to play a song, if you uh, sing along to it. And I always just tell my kids that the same thing, you know, like if you sing along with a song, it just helps out so much, like just with the timing and everything. So learn to sing straight away on guitar, while playing guitar, I should say, really invaluable for uh, later on in life when you keep playing. Oh, you know, so I'm playing with a capo here on uh, uh, the first fret, that's just for my singing voice, again, it just uh, makes it a bit easier to sing than uh, playing it in normal G. This chord's still the same though. That's it. So the chords of the song, um, I'll take the capo off now just so I can show you how to play the chords without the capo, because um, it has changed, um, and they just become exactly the same once the capo is there, but it's just easy to show you this. So, first chord is G, uh, naughty finger right here, top, um, top I call it the top string just because it's at the top for you when you're playing guitar, I know that's not what it actually is. Next one down is uh, second row, second string down from the top. And your third finger can just be right down here on the bottom, or you can use your pinky if you want. Third finger, um, bottom string, third row, third fret. Let's get a close look at that, yeah. Uh, next up is the D chord, okay. First finger here on the third string up from the bottom. The second finger, your naughty finger, you know, if you're playing, you know, doing the fingers, is uh, the bottom string. And your third finger. Third row, second string up from the bottom. And G, D, and that's pretty much the whole, all of the chords you'll need to know. So the strum just looks sounds like this. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, and let's change them to D. Awesome song for singing along with kids and also at Paul Fiddy. Cool. Thank you, everyone.